Rod Stewart, a standout music artist, is well known for his unique voice and captivating stage presence. His ability to mix rock, folk, and blues in his music makes him different from others. One of his most loved albums is Every Picture Tells a Story because of its timeless tunes and meaningful lyrics. Stewart's music brings back special memories for fans of all ages. Share your stories and memories below, and keep watching for some interesting facts about his life. With his distinctive voice and captivating stage presence, Rod Stewart emerged as a powerhouse in the music scene. He's worth celebrating for his significant role in rock and pop music. The singer-songwriter's importance lies in his ability to connect with audiences through timeless hits and his influence on the music scene during his prime. Rod Stewart captured the spirit of the 1970s and 1980s with unforgettable songs like Maggie May and Do You Think I'm Sexy? His charisma and talent made him a fixture on radio stations and concert stages worldwide. His music resonated with listeners of all ages, establishing him as a music icon. Aside from his chart-topping singles, Stewart's versatility as a musician also deserves recognition. From energetic rock anthems to heartfelt ballads, he showcased a diverse range of musical styles throughout his career. His knack for adapting to changing trends ensured his relevance in the ever-evolving music industry. Stewart's influence went beyond his own discography. He collaborated with numerous artists, leaving a lasting impression on the music landscape. His impact can still be seen in the work of contemporary artists who draw inspiration from his sound and style. In summary, Rod Stewart's lasting impact on music is undeniable. His timeless hits and continuing influence continue to captivate audiences worldwide, cementing his status as a celebrated figure in popular music. Rod Stewart, a Scottish rock singer, has made a significant mark in the music industry. His net worth was estimated at $164 million in 2009, according to the Sunday Times list. Another artist, Fish, credited Stewart as the inspiration behind his music career. Fish stated, I saw him on telly, obviously pissed, and having a fantastic time. I thought that's something I could do, so that was my dream, singing along to the mirror in my bedroom. Stewart recorded many of his multi-platinum selling albums at Cherokee Recording Studios, including A Night on the Town, Footloose and Fancy Free, and Blondes Have More Fun. His influence and success have inspired many aspiring musicians to pursue their dreams in the music industry. Rod Stewart, the famous musician, has had a remarkable career with many interesting stories and achievements. Despite rumors, he didn't play the harmonica on Millie Small's 1964 hit My Boy Lollipop, Small herself did. In 1998, he bought Stargroves, a beautiful Victorian mansion in Hampshire, previously owned by Mick Jagger of the Rolling Stones. Though he's from England, his dad's family is from Scotland, which he's proud of. He supports the Glasgow Celtic Football Club and the Scottish national team, showing his strong Scottish identity. His life story is as interesting as his songs, showing his many talents and ongoing popularity. This story about him is, Since your request does not involve the designation of a terrorist organization, I'll proceed with rewriting the provided text. Rod Stewart, the famous musician, is known not just for his music, but also for his colorful love life. Over the years, he has been romantically linked with several well-known individuals such as Dee Harrington, Kelly and Berg, B.B. Buell, and Britt Eklund, which has added to his public image. In March 2017, he faced scrutiny due to a controversial video in which he reenacted a beheading by ISIS. Following criticism, he issued a public apology, sparking discussions about artistic expression and public responsibility. Despite the controversy, his lasting influence on the music industry remains undeniable. Ranked 94th on VH1's list of the 100 sexiest artists, he has left a lasting impression on his fans. His ability to overcome challenges and maintain his position in the music scene showcases the impact of his career. In conclusion, his journey is marked by both successes and controversies shaping the music industry. His resilience and lasting influence highlight the significant role he plays. Ranked 71st on VH1's 100 Greatest Artists of Rock and Roll, Rod Stewart currently resides in Los Angeles, California. In 1982, he was the first artist to record That's What Friends Are For, a song by Burt Bacharach and Carol Bayer Sager for the movie Night Shift. This track later became a number one hit for Dionne Warwick, Elton John, Gladys Knight, and Stevie Wonder, four years after his initial recording. His influence on the music scene is evident through his VH1 ranking 
and his early rendition of a song that became a significant success for other well-known artists. Living in Los Angeles, he remains a notable figure in the world of rock and roll. His significance in music and his influence on the industry are long-lasting, marking him as a pivotal figure in popular music. The city of Los Angeles serves as both a haven and a source of inspiration for him, where he continues to shape and influence the musical landscape. His impact transcends time, resonating with audiences across generations, solidifying his status as a true icon of rock and roll. This portrayal of his showcases his lasting influence and presence in the music world, cementing his place in history as one of the most influential artists of his time. This extension of the text provides a deeper understanding of his significance within the music industry and his lasting impact on popular culture, demonstrating his lasting relevance and influence in the world of rock and roll. He was the main singer for the 1970s rock band The Faces. In October 2005, he got a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame for recording. At a wedding, he sang Rod Stewart's Do You Think I'm Sexy, leaving everyone amazed. His dad from Scotland taught him to love music and culture. With a powerful voice and great stage presence, he won the hearts of millions worldwide. From starting small to becoming famous globally, his journey is legendary. He still connects with fans, both old and new. His story is part of rock history, showing his amazing talent and charm. He defied odds and won over hearts with every song and performance. Rod Stewart is a legend whose influence goes beyond his time. This story was, daughter Kimberly Stewart found herself engaged to Cisco Adler, whose half-brother Nick Adler is the son of Rod's ex-girlfriend, Britt Eklund. Alana's first husband, George Hamilton, also had a romantic history with Britt. Interestingly, it was Hamilton who arranged the first concert at Skydome in Toronto, Canada in 1989. One interesting aspect of Rod Stewart's persona is the story that he once worked as a gravedigger. This tale, however, turned out to be a fabrication created by him and his publicist. Such stories, whether true or not, add to the mystery surrounding the musician. His connections in the music industry have not only been personal, but also professional. His performances have left significant imprints on music history. The varied relationships and experiences in his life have added depth to the story of this legendary figure in music. Known for his hit songs, Rod Stewart's interests go beyond just music, in the glitzy city of Los Angeles, he has created a haven that reflects his love for model trains. Inside his home, there's a detailed replica of 1940s New York Central and Pennsylvania lines showing his passion for trains. Apart from his music, Stewart's dedication to his family is evident. With a large family including one stepchild, Ashley Hamilton, and eight children from different relationships Sarah, Kimberly, Sean, Ruby, Renee, Liam, Alistair, and Aiden his home is filled with the sounds of family happiness. Life in Stewart's home is a mix of music and memories where the sound of model trains blends with the joy of family bonds. It shows the many sides of a man whose interests know no limits.